Hey there guys, Zach here from Embazer and welcome back to another video. Now today we're taking a look at Windows 10 build 10176. This build is pretty much identical to the last public preview build which was 10166. This build is also a leaked RTM candidate build meaning this build is one of the many builds Microsoft is compiling that could be the RTM. I know for a fact that this build in particular is not the RTM as uh, Microsoft has have compiled a number of other builds since for RTM candidates. This one did not pass testing. However, this is what the RTM will look like. This is all the code underneath is practic practically done. There's uh, rather obviously there's a couple of issues in this build that Microsoft needs to fix before RTMing. So uh, minus a few bugs, this is what the RTM will look like and feel like and act. So in this build, there are no new features or differences from 166. There, there are only a couple of changes. One, on the desktop, there is no longer a watermark as on the Windows 10 RTM. Consumers, when they, get, when they receive the build, aren't going to want to see the build number on the desktop or what version of Windows they're running, much like on Windows 7 or Windows 8 or Windows XP or any version of Windows ever. Any uh, consumer version of Windows doesn't have the build number on the desktop unless it isn't activated or something like that so that's why it's been removed by default and if we go into Winver here which can be accessed through searching here in Cortana you'll notice that the branding of Windows 10 is here and the time bomb has been removed as obviously with the RTM there will be no time bomb as this is a consumer product which should be activated and licensed correctly uh, so yes, the Windows 10 branding is here and it should also show up in uh, PC settings, not PC settings, uh, system properties, which is here. Here we go, Windows 10, the branding here. This is the Windows 10 Enterprise version because it only leaked in Enterprise. Like I said, this is a leaked build, it isn't in an official build. Um, there's not really anything else new. Uh, build 166 is very close to as at to an RTM and 176 is just an RTM candidate so there was no there really isn't any differences here um the build is pretty responsive uh pretty good I I have no issues with it by lots of things uh the RTM should be compiled sometimes next sometime next week Microsoft will be voting on a number of builds this one as I said did not pass the QA testing but a couple of uh, they've compiled newer builds since and those builds will be uh, put through testing and then next week will be voted on and if a build finally passes QA They will take that build re recompile it and send it out to OEMs and then on July 29th That will be the build that goes out to the public So we're very close to the end now guys This is probably with the one of the last builds we're going to review before RTM actually happens because To be fair you can't get any closer to RTM than this build unless the RTM was already compiled as uh this is an RTM candidate. This build was compiled with the intention of being the RTM. So um, there you have it, guys. That's a quick look at Windows 10 build 10176. Thanks so much for watching, and I shall see you in the next one. Bye-bye.